Hey guys, Ethan here, or Culture, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to use, how to cop, and how to set up the Force Cop Supreme Bot. First, I'll show you how to install it, how to use it, and how to set it up and do some tips, and then after, I'll do the Supreme Bot in action. So if you want to skip to that part, just click the annotation right here. Alright, let's begin. So right after purchasing, you'll get an email from Force Cop. I believe it's named Force Cop Supreme Bot Delivery. Open that email and you'll see a link to register your license. Click that link, register as prompted, and since I'm already registered, I'll skip it. But once you're registered, go to your dashboard. The dashboard is supreme.forcecop.com slash login. Go there, and once you're here, sign in with the information that you put in when you registered. Log in, and you should be on this page. To download the bot, you go right here and you click it. Then it should bring you to the Chrome web page where you could click add to Chrome, add extension, and then there'll be a red F. I like to bring it to the front. So click the red F and log in. All right, once you log in, you'll be on this page. So select your size. I'll set it up for a friend's tee, for example. So you select your size, uh, your shoe size, your hat size, uh, the category. I don't, I won't put any for now. Keyword finder. So the keyword finder always keep the refresh interval at two, because that seems to be the best one. It's the default one, and you should probably play it safe. And then if you have the the pro version, you could add or remove multiple keywords if you have three or just one. Keywords will be posted on my video drop lists or when I review the drop list at the end of the video, I'll usually post the videos. So subscribe to me for those keywords. But for example, a keyword would be the item name and the color. So I would put Frensty Black and that would be it. Then go to timer. Timer is if you're not at your computer, you could set up the timer. Even if you're at, I like to put it in, but you do that or to 10, 15, 59 AM. And it'll show a countdown timer. I'll show you the page after, and you could do that. The keyword finder, since there are no nothing, there's nothing dropping right now. I won't put it, but that's I showed you. The checkout delay is three seconds or more. Keep that there so they don't get ghost ordered. If you don't know what a ghost order is, it's when you purchase something and you see the order confirmation on the site, but you don't end up getting an email or anything. And then proxy settings, you input your proxy using that button and it'll prompt you to input the proxy. If you don't know what a proxy is, I'll be uploading a video on what that is soon, so feel free to check that out and subscribe to see that. Under proxies, there's add to cart and checkout. Any size, will choose any size and it will dis disregard anything that you put in. Add to cart will automatically add the item to cart when you're on the page, and checkout will automatically check out, which is the whole point of the bot, so I'll always put that. This bot has a very, very cool option, which is display images on or off. So for example, off, I'll show you how it is. It goes here, save, it'll start the timer, and here it is. This is pretty much really weird, but it doesn't show any of the images on the site. So that, let's say your, your internet is really slow, or you're using like a public school Wi-Fi or anything, it'll take not as long to load. I usually have fast internet, so I like to keep it on just to see and end up seeing what it's like, but that's really useful. And then you save, obviously, and you go, it'll bring you to the site thing. Then you could go to the three dot, the three dashes right here and enter in your checkout info. I'll put fake info, obviously, so that you don't see my real one, but. So then go back to your first cop bot thing and um, the timer if you keep it on I'll show how it is. It's 751. I'll put at like 75230 and save. It'll bring you to the page and it'll go there. Since it's already 75220, but I'll show you like a 40. Save. Brings you to the page. There you go at 7. But how it works pretty much is it Counts down the timer and automatically goes to the website. I'll keep it off for now. Then you'll just click start. I have it all set up. And 
here you just with a keyword finder it would automatically go to the item and check out but since i have no keyword finder i could just go to this item at the cart or size is unavailable so i'll put any size save and let's redo that i want to go this here you go added to cart it's checking out putting all the fake information and it would process payment obviously i would sell that capacia and um then it, it would work <laughs> see card expired but a good tip to not get capacha is this you go to this site right here and in your browsing session you solve the capacha you go to the storefront obviously i'll pick those and submit then it would show this and obviously it's google so then after when you check out you usually won't get the capacha at checkout which is really cool and shout out to Caleb, he showed me his link is in the description. But that's a trick for no capacho. Then um, to log out of the bot, you just click that, and that's it. Another feature that I really think this bot is really, really good at is here, I'll go. I'll go to Supreme and shop. If you usually know, Supreme's shop doesn't show every single item or enlarged. But because of this bot, whenever you have this bot installed, it will show this. I think this is by far one of my favorite features ever because I always hate having to go to the category and also seeing that the item, let's say it's sold out, you have to hover over it or I'm pretty sure you also have to um, go to the item. So it really sucks. But here you could just tell when the item is sold out or not. So that's really probably one of the best features hands down. If you have any more questions, feel free to join my Discord right here. Comment anything in the description remember to subscribe for more videos like this or anything that you would like to know and like this video so that i get more views and i'm cool <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching have a great rest of the week and bye